Now, Unity Christian and Western Christian, boys varsity matchup from Hall. We'll tip it off in two minutes. You're listening to High School Basketball on KIHK. We're thinking about jewelry, and if you're not, you should be. If you're buying an expensive piece of jewelry, such as a diamond, put your trust in someone you know. Trust is when you expose your vulnerabilities to someone and believe that they won't take advantage of your openness. That's my pledge here at Centerstone. I promise to give you the best jewelry possible for the hard-earned money that you spend. You trust just any store for this? Maybe you should trust us, like thousands of other faithful customers. Remember, for a lifetime of memories, Centerstone Jewelers, North Highway 75 in Sioux Center. We all want convenience. It makes life easier. And you'll find life is much easier when you use Iowa State Bank's full line of convenient online services. Do your banking when you want, where you want, with iowastatebank.net. Check your balances. Pay your bills with ReadyNet Bill Pay. Have your statements sent to you electronically with e-statements. Now, Iowa State Bank is wherever you and your computer are. Enjoy the freedom and convenience of iowastatebank.net. Iowa State Bank. Remember FDIC. The best way to buy your insurance is from an independent agent like me, Jeff Coldmoder, and see my insurance from the professional insurance consultant's closet. I'll get you coverage on your home, auto, or health. We hunt through lots of different companies to get you the best possible coverage at the best rates. That's Sewer Insurance. Hey, the good about you. Consultants Plaza at the corner of Main yeah. Street and Highway 18 in Rock Valley. I'm Jeff Coldwell, and let me save you money on your insurance coverage. See some red, save some green. This is Evan from Highway Chevrolet Buick in Rock Valley. We're offering 0% financing for 60 months on all remaining new 2007 BLT Chevrolets during GM's red pay event, or two rebates up to $3,000. The new 2000 new Silverados have financing as low as 1.9%. We also have $1,000 rebates on new 2008 Lucerne's, and we have nine in stock. Check out our new used inventory on the web at highwaychevrolet.com. Highway Chevrolet Buick, a big city selection, a smart car atmosphere, and the best service ever. We're set to jump it up. Opening tip controlled by Western Christian. Underway, Kaiser with it on the left wing for the Wolf Pack. Out high it comes to Fatma. Fatma will bounce it inside to Ben Browse. Turn around, jumper up and good. And Western jumps out on top by a score of two to nothing. Curtis Finn Grau with the field goal underneath for the Wolfpack. Now Unity with the ball. Rowan Horse top of the key. He bounces it inside. Uh, ducking around the defender is Austin Tachi. His shot no good. Rebound poked around and grabbed by Jeremy Zutenhorst of Western. A foul called on Unity. Foul underneath. Western whistled on Taylor Dreis of the Knights, and Western will have the ball back. Walter Storff into the front court, right side pass, it comes off to Kaiser. Kaiser at the top of the key for Western, bounces it right side to Fatma. Fatma, top of the key now, it comes over to Van Grau, now out front, back it comes to Fatma. Fatma at the top of the circle, bounces it inside. Walter Storff with the turnaround jumper, good for two, and Western out to a four to nothing advantage. Unity with the basketball, Rowan Hooks will bring it up the floor for the Knights. He's guarded out there by Walter Storff. Out high to Dreis, now to Kachi. Kachi into the right corner to Dreis in the paint. His pull-up jumper good for two. Unity on the board. Taylor Dreis with the field goal underneath. Four to two, Western with the advantage. In the basketball, Wolfback with it. Fatma, top of the key to Vendrow. Left side to Walter Storff. In now to Kaiser. Kaiser working the paint. His jump hook no good. Rebound tipped away from Dreis, but it's grabbed out there by Hoekstra. And into the front court come the Knights. Kachi with a basketball in the right corner. He's bumped. Fatma whistled for the personal. That's his first. Team foul number one on the Wolfpack. So Unity will have the ball out of bounds. 6.25 left to go in the first quarter. 4-2, Western with the advantage. Unity with the basketball. Inbounds pass to Kachi. Underneath to Dreis. Dreis working the post. His turnaround jumper won't fall. Rebound cleared by Zoot and the horse for Western. Back the other way, Walter Storff. Right wing it comes to Fatma. Fatma, top of the key. Zoot and the horse. He'll let it fly from 17. It rims out no good. Dreis clears the rebound for Unity Christian. And the Knights will come back the other way. Rowanhorse across the timeline. He's guarded by Walter Storff. Rowanhorse coming up the floor, draws a foul. 
Reach in foul whistled on Western. That's going to be on Trevor Waltersdorf. That's his first personal. Team foul number two on the Wolfpack. Unity will have the ball out of bounds. Ryan Hoekstra will trigger it in for the Knights. Hoekstra inbounds pass to Roundhorse. Roundhorse at the top of the key for the Knights. Roundhorse, man-to-man -man defense for Western. Left side pass to Hoekstra. Hoekstra into Dreis across the lane to Kachi. His turnaround jumper good for two. Austin Kachi ties the score at 4-4. Four four. Now Western back the other way. Walter Storff trying to get it inside for to uh, Zutenhorse. Poked away by Kachi. But a reach-in foul called on Austin Kachi of Unity. Kachi whistled for his first. Team foul number two on the Knights. Western will have it out of bounds. Kaiser with the inbounds pass to Fatma. Right wing Kaiser at three is up and good. Sean Kaiser drills the triple. And Western has a 7-4 to four advantage. Unity with the basketball. Kachi at the top of the key. Drives right side. Dishes off. Left side. Jumper for Dreis is up and no good. Zutenhorst clears the rebound for Western. Back come the Wolfpack. Top of the key. Fatma pulls up. Hits the jumper. Trevor Waltersdorf. Not Fatma. It was Waltersdorf. A 9-4 Western lead. Unity with the basketball. Hoekstra trying to go baseline into Kachi. And he is fouled. Foul called on Kevin Fatma of Western. He picks up his second personal with 5.01 left to go in the first quarter. Unity will have the ball out of bounds. Tonight's game brought to you in part by Iowa State Bank, Vans and Siouxland Insurance, and the Professional Insurance Consultant Plaza in Rock Valley. Kachi misses a turnaround jumper. Rebound cleared by Vin Grau for Western. Back the other way, Walter Storff leaves it off to Kaiser. Kaiser inside to Zutenhorst, muscles it up, no good. Rebound tipped out and grabbed by Walter Storff. Let's it fly from the left wing, no good. Dreis with the rebound for Unity. And the Knights will bring it back the other way. Roundhorse pushes it ahead. Now Roundhorse kicks it out to Hoekstra. Hoekstra traveled with a basketball. Unity commits the turnover. Joel Giesink is into the Western lineup now. He'll replace Kevin Fotma. And in for the first time tonight for Unity, Lucas Kurtzleben, a 6'2 senior, who's a starter for the last, for the Knights a year ago. But has missed the first two games this year with an injury. Gasink into the front court for Western. To the right wing to Kaiser. Top of the key now to Walterstorff. Back out to Gasink, lobbing back door for Walterstorff. Mistimed his lead, but got the ball and hits the turnaround jumper. Walter Storff makes it 11 to 4 in favor of Western. Now Unity with the ball. Kachi across the lane feeds it off. Kurtzleben banks it in for two. Lucas Kurtzleben underneath. 11 6 or score. Back the other way. Western, a traveling violation. Unity will have the ball back. Timeout taken by Unity coach Ross Bauma. We'll come back after this 30 second break. Western 11, Unity 6. You're listening to high school basketball ball on KIHK. Well, we'll keep things right here. 3.58 left to go in the first quarter. Western 11, Unity 6. Tonight's game sponsored in part by Highway Chevrolet Buick, Vin Monins for Hoof Automotive, and by the station in Hall. Western with the 11-6 advantage here early on. It'll be Unity's basketball. Western's going to put on some full-court pressure. Jack Verberg, who checked into the Western lineup. Michael Van Ingen also in there. Now a steal by Western, uh, taken by Grandstrup. Renan Grandstrup, but his outlet pass is thrown away, and Western gives the ball right back to Unity. Again, full-court press put on by Western. Inbounds pass to Kachi, ahead to Hoekstra. Hoekstra across the wing to Kachi. The Kurtzleben out to Kachi, Austin Kachi to Dustin Kachi, left side Hoekstra lets it fly from the corner, in and out, no good, underneath, Rowanhorst with the rebound back up and in. James Rowanhorst down low off the offensive glass, it's 11 to 8, Western with the lead, now three-pointer on the other end for Walter score. 14 to 8 in favor of Western. Unity coming back up the floor, Hoekstra is fouled, going into the baseline. And uh, are they going to shoot him, or is it going to be on the floor? 
They're going to call it on the floor. The foul on Western charged to Michael Van Ingen, his first. Unity's ball inbounds past the Round Horse. Baseline jumper up and good for James Round Horse. Four for Round Horse. 14 to 10 our score. Western by four. Walter Storff into the front court. Walter Storff, top of the circle, gives the ball up to Jack Verberg. Now around the right side, it comes to Grandstrip. Brennan Grandstrip, top of the key. Walter Storff drives left side, whistle, reach in foul called on Unity. I believe it's going to be on one of the Kachi boys. Nope, it's on James Roundhorse. Roundhorse picks up his first personal, and Western will have the ball out of bounds. Western, Grandstra will trigger it in. Comes in to Vinningen, out high, long three for Walterstorf, no good. Offensive rebound underneath to Verberg, and he is fouled on his way back up. He'll go to the line to shoot two. Let's see who they uh, charge that to. Jack Verberg goes to the free throw line. Not sure who they called the foul on. Number three up on the board. Unity A doesn't have a number three. First free throw for Verberg is no good. Another free throw for Verberg on the way. That one is no good. Unity grabs the rebound. Austin Kachi comes away with it. Into the front court. Hoekstra bounces underneath. Kurt Swaven with the reverse layup. Good for two. Kurt Schwaben has four, 14 to 12. Western's lead is two. Now Verberg gives it off to Walterstorff. Top of the key, drops. Trevor Walterstorff has 11 in the first quarter for Western. Now the full court pressure by Western and Unity turns it over. 16 to 12, Western with the lead. And Unity turnover gives the ball back to the Wolfpack. And a new crew of players checks in for Western Christian. Zutenhorst and Gaysink back in there, along with Kaiser. And then Grau, here's the inbounds pass, tipped by Gaysink, but he tracks it down near midcourt. Right side pass to Walterstorff, around to Kaiser. Kaiser back to Gaysink, to Kaiser. Left wing, shoots the three, no good. Fight for the rebound, it's cleared by Unity. Grabbed underneath there by Travis Deckers. Back in the Knights. Kachi, Austin Kachi with it. Top of the key to Hoekstra. Right saying round horse to Kachi. Goes off his hands. Picked up by Kaiser. Kaiser takes it the length of the floor. Gets the layup and draws a foul. And Kaiser going in, initiating the contact with Austin Kachi. Kaiser gets the bucket and the foul on Kachi. 18 to 12 in favor of Western. Fouls out Austin Kachi, his second. And at the free throw line, trying to complete a three-point play is Sean Kaiser for Western. He puts it up and good. Six points for Kaiser, 19 to 12 in favor of the Wolfpack. Roundhorse into front court for Unity. Roundhorse, bounce pass, right side to Kachi. Top of the key, Hoekstra. Hoekstra on the dribble, pull up jumper in the lane, good for two. Ryan Hoekstra with his first bucket of the night. 19-14 our score. Western back the other way. Gaysink into Zutenhorst. Zutenhorst turnaround jumper blocked. Foul called underneath on Taylor Dreis. Nope, Travis Deckers called for the foul. That's his first. And Jeremy Zutenhorst will go to the line for Western. Zutenhorst averaged 15.3 points a game a year ago. He was a 69% free throw shooter. Hits the first. That's his first point tonight. Makes the score 20 to 14. Western with the lead. Second free throw for Jeremy Zutenhorst on the way. And good. He gets them both. 21-14. Western a seven-point advantage. Western on a little 7-2 run here. Unity with the ball. Hoekstra at the free throw line. Nearly lost it. Right side to Kachi. Kachi coming through the lane. Draws a foul. They charge that to Sean Kaiser of Western. His first personal. 
They call it on the floor, so it'll be Unity's ball out of bounds. Unity will trigger it in. Conchie will throw it in from the baseline. Still looking. Conchie gets it in to Hoekstra, but the right hand lays it up no good. Zutenhorst with the rebound back the other way. Zutenhorst gets tripped up coming up the floor. And a foul called on Unity. That one charged to Ryan Hoekstra. That's his first personal. Jeremy Zutenhorst will go to the line for Western to shoot two. No, one and one. That's 17 fouls on Unity. One and one for Zutenhorst. Puts the first one up and in. 22 to 14. Western on an 8-2 to two run. Tonight's game brought to you in part by Miss Z's in Rock Valley. Buyer auction in Real Estate, the Young Hardware, and the American State Bank. Zutenhorst's second free throw is good. 23-14, to 9-point advantage for Western. A minute 15 left to go in the first quarter. Tachi left wing to the free throw line. Turns, trying to dump it off for Deckers. Tipped by Zutenhorst, out of bounds off of Deckers. Unity with their fifth turnover of the quarter, and Western will have the ball back. Kaiser, check that. Waltersdorf will bring it into the front court for Western. Waltersdorf, left side pass to Kaiser. One minute left to go in the quarter, a nine-point lead for Western. Out on the left wing is Vin Grau. And Grau out high to Waltersdorf. Underneath, Zutenhorst muscles it up, no good. A foul called on the rebound. That's going to be on Jeremy Zutenhorst of Western for going over the back. Zutenhorst picks up his first. Unity will have the ball with 50.2 seconds left. Roundhorse into the front court for the Knights. Roundhorse, top of the key, right side to Kachi. Underneath to Dreis. Dreis with the turnaround jumper. No good off the front of the rim. Rebound into the corner. It's tracked down by Sean Kaiser for Western. Western uh, back the other way. Kaiser into the front court for the Wolfpack. Kaiser at the top of the key, bounces it into Zutenhorst. Zutenhorst going baseline, kicks out to Kaiser. Left side, Wolterstorff, a three, no good. Roundhorst there to grab the rebound for Unity. Roundhorst up the floor, 17 seconds left. James Roundhorst on the dribble. Top of the circle, left side, Kachi. Kachi on the drive to the baseline, feeds it off. Dreis, 12-footer, good. Taylor Dreis has four, 23-16, half-court shot at the buzzer, no good. Zutenhorst with the rebound, they didn't get it off in time. 23-16, our score at the end of one, Western in front of Unity. Back with the start of the second quarter in a minute, you're listening to High School Basketball on KIHK. Doug? Yep. Four for you. Okay. Hang on a second. Okay. Okay, shoot. Biblio, 69-61. Okay. Sheldon and Spear Lake got postponed due to the uh, rain, or freezing rain. Is it raining out? Up uh, north by Spear Lake it is. Oh, okay. Uh, and uh, Lamar's and Cherokee. Lamar's 62-48. Okay. That's what I've got for you. 20 seconds. All right. Thorough inspection of your vehicle. We will inspect your brakes, wipers, shocks, exhaust, belts and hoses, alignment, check fluid levels, and check for leaks, all for the low price of $27.50. Plus, you'll receive a complimentary wash job. Call the Hook Service Department at 722-0076 and make your appointment today. For Hook Automotive, where we care about you and your vehicle. Start of the second quarter here in Hull. Western Christian 23, Unity Christian 16. Unity with the basketball. Kachi tries a three and it's good. Dustin Kachi with the triple. And that makes it 23 to 19 in favor of Western. Western with the basketball. Van Grau out high. Left side it goes to Kaiser. Kaiser drives baseline, feeds it off across the lane, tipped away and stolen by Kurt Slavin for Unity. Back come the Knights. Hoekstra on the right wing. Hoekstra to the baseline with the right hand off the glass and in. Nice shot by Ryan Hoekstra. 23-21, Unity back to within two. Into the front court, Waltersdorf for Western. Around the left side it goes to Fatma, out to Waltersdorf. Lobbed underneath, Van Grau with position. He banks it in for two. 
25-21 in favor of Western. Unity back the other way, Roundhorse into the front court. Top of the circle, James Roundhorse. Left side pass, Kachi. Kachi on the move, pull up jumper, good for Dustin Kachi. Kachi with his second bucket of the quarter, 25-23. A two point lead for Western. Walterstorf right wing, inside to Zutenhorst. Zutenhorst splits the defense with the left hand off the glass and in. Jeremy Zutenhorst with a nice move in the post. 27-23, Western with the lead. Now Roundhorse drives right side, feeds it off. Dreis, right corner, his jumper is good. Well, the team's coming out here in the second quarter and trading baskets. Two-point lead for Western, 27-25. The Wolfpack is led by as many as nine. Zutenhorst with the free throw line jumper for Western. 29-25 in favor of the Wolfpack. Brown horse into the front court for Unity. Left side pass to Hoekstra. Top of the key, Kachi. Three ball on the way, missed it. Dreis saves it from going out of bounds, but picked up by Zutenhorst, and now Western throws it away, coming up the floor. And Unity will have the basketball. Ryan Visser checks into the uh, Unity lineup here. Joel Gasek in for Western. Unity will have the basketball here. Use the inbounds pass to Roundhorse. Roundhorse guarded by Waltersdorf. Roundhorse top of the key. Picks up the dribble. Right side pass comes to Visser. Western gets four players up off the bench. The Kamikaze crew set to check in. Hoekstra misses the jumper in the lane. Then Grau clears the rebound for Western. Back in the Wolf pack. Waltersdorf right side to Gasink. In to Zutenhorst. Whistle and a foul underneath called on Unity. That's going to be charged to Lucas Kurtzleben, his first personal. Team foul number eight on the Knights. Jeremy Zutenhorst to the free throw line. So Jordan Vogel, Jack Verberg check into the Western lineup. Free throw for Zutenhorst, up and good. Nine for Jeremy Zutenhorst. 30 to 25 in favor of the Wolfpack. Second free throw for Zutenhorst up and in. And he'll come out now. Michael Veningen will check in for Western. 31-25. Western back to a six-point lead. Full court pressure put on by the Wolfpack. Unity with the ball. Inbounds to Roundhorse. Roundhorse tried to pass for Visser. Poked away and stolen by Western. That was a steal. Picked off. Pass picked off by Jordan Vogel, and now a foul called on Unity. That one charged to Taylor Dreis. That's his second personal. One and one will put Brennan Granstra to the free throw line for Western. Granstra to the line to shoot a one and one. 19 fouls on Unity. Free throw is good for Brennan Granstra. 32-25. Five unanswered points scored for Western. Second free throw for Granstra on the way, and that one is good. So 33-25 in favor of Western. Dreis is out, and Kachi checks back into the Unity lineup. Full court press put on by Western. Unity with the basketball. Roundhorse is fouled by Jordan Vogel. Vogel picks up his first personal. That's team foul number seven on Western. So James Rowanhorse will go to the line for Unity. Rowanhorse to the free throw line. Shooting 85% at the line. First one on the way and good. The Rowanhorse, he's got five points tonight. 33-26, Western the lead. Tonight's game brought to you in part by Floral Expressions, Jerry's Car Quest, Windmill Park Jewelry, and Missouri River Energy Services. Second free throw also good for James Rowanhorse. 33-27, Unity trying some full court pressure itself. Granstra into the front court, top of the key, Waltersdorf, free throw line jumper, good. 12 for Trevor Waltersdorf. 35-27, eight-point advantage again for Western. Unity breaks the pressure. Kachi on the right wing, poked away by the ding, and Kachi gets it back, puts it on the floor, and an offensive foul on Kachi as he runs into uh, 
Michael Vanignan. Dustin Tachi picks up his second personal foul. And it'll be Western's ball back. Now Zutenhorst and Fatma back into the Western lineup along with Kaiser. And Waltersdorf and Van Grau starting five back in there now for Western. Kaiser at midcourt with it for the Wolf uh, for the Wolfpack. Left side pass to Waltersdorf. Top of the key to Van Grau. Right wing to Kaiser. Now to Zutenhorst at the free throw line. Back over to Kaiser. Kaiser fakes right, goes left through the lane, and a foul called on Unity. That'll be charged to Travis Deckers of the Knights. That's his second personal. Team foul number 10, Kaiser will go to the line to shoot two for Western. 4.48 left to go until halftime, an eight-point Western Christian lead, 35-27. Sean Kaiser at the free throw line for Western Christian. And his first free throw is up and good. 36-27, a nine-point advantage. Western has equaled their biggest lead of the game. Second free throw is good, and it's a 10-point lead for Western. 37-27, Deckers comes out. Kurtzleben back into the Unity lineup. Unity with the ball, 4.48 left to go in the half. Rowan Horse into the front court. Western playing a 2-3 zone. Left wing, it was Visser out front to Rowan Horse. Back around to Kachi to Rowan Horse. He'll shoot a three, no good off the front of the rim. Long rebound, tracked down by Van Grau in the corner, falling out of bounds. He throws it out off of Hoopstrup, and Western will have the basketball. Tonight's game on KIHK brought to you in part by Ski Mount Window and Door, DeYoung Hardware, Hague Memorial Hospital and Health Center, and People's Bank. Kaiser into the front court for Western. Left wing it goes to Waltersdorf. Out front to Ben Ground, out of Kaiser. Waltersdorf again to Zutenhorst down the right side of the lane. Zutenhorst trying to save it from going out of bounds. Picked up by Kurtzleben. Unity back the other way. Roundhorst to the hole. Lays it up and good. James Roundhorst. For Unity, now a steal by Unity, picked up by Kachi. Here's Roundhorse again with the right hand up and good. Ten for Roundhorse, 37-31. Now Western, left wing, a three on the way, good! Three-pointer for Kevin Fatma. 40-31, right back up to a nine-point lead for the Wolfpack. Roundhorse top of the key for Unity, left wing to Visser. In the corner, Kurtzleben, back to Roundhorse. Roundhorse, left side pass, poked away by Walterstorff, a steal. Walterstorff goes all the way for the breakaway dunk. 42-31 in favor of Western. Kachi coming through the lane, goes over Van Grau, and an offensive foul called on Dustin Kachi of Unity. That's his third personal, and Unity will take a timeout. 3.24 and left to go until halftime. 42-31 in favor of Western. Back in a minute, you're listening to High School Basketball on KIHK. As a mechanic, I know the importance. Doug, no score for you. What? No score for you. Joe's Little Rock, 60. Boyden Hall, 30. 60 to 30, George. Okay. I got about 40 seconds. Okay. Vehicle running like noon. Ask for the power steering or transmission flush at the station in Hall on the corner of 18 and Main Street. Just look for the checkered flag. Announcing the return of Miss Z's full serve. Oh, yeah, 12 to 10. Austin Center over MOC start of the second quarter. Okay. Starting Tuesday the 4th, the noon lunch buffet returns every Tuesday through Friday. Miss Z's will be back to their previous hours and back to their great dining specials, too. Don't forget their Saturday night prime rib returns on December the 8th. Remember, Miss Z's is again serving their fabulous food starting Tuesday, December the 4th, so be sure to come in. 3.24 left to go until halftime. Western with an 11-point advantage, 42-31. Gaysink into the front court for the Wolfpack. To the right wing, Waltersdorf to Gaysink. Left side it goes to Fatma. They'll skip it back across to Gaysink. Now to Fatma, top of the key, fires for three. No good. Waltersdorf, the rebound back up and in. 16 in the first half for Trevor Waltersdorf. 
44-31 in favor of Western. Unity the basketball. Left side it goes. Visser hits a three-pointer. Ryan Visser with the three for Unity. 44-34, Western by 10. Western with the basketball. Gaysink at the top of the circle. Gaysink will bring it back out to midcourt. Western will set it up. Unity playing a zone. 3-2, 1-2-2 zone. L lob back door for Walter Stork. He missed time his jump. A rebound comes off to Hoekstra for Unity and a foul on Western. Foul charge to Jeremy Zutenhorst of Western. That's his second personal. And uh, free throws coming up for Unity. And we'll put uh, Ryan Hoekstra to the free throw line for the Knights. Unity had climbed to within six at 37-31. Here's the free throw. No good. Walterstorff grabs the rebound. Gasing pushes it into the front court. Top of the key to Walterstorff. Over to Gasing. Back out to Walterstorff. He'll shoot the three. In and out. No good. Western crashes the boards. Put back is no good for Zutenhorst. Rebound comes off to J.D. Ployme for Unity. And uh, back come the Knights with the jumper. Three-pointer for the Unity. Not sure who hit that one. Two minutes left to go. 44-37. Western coming back the other way. And the ball tipped by Hoekstra. It goes out of bounds off of Unity. Still Western's ball. J.D. Ployme with the three-pointer for Unity. 44-37, Western with the basketball, a seven-point lead. Waltersdorf, right wing, Gasing coming through the lane, kicks it out, Fatma for three, up and no good, offensive rebound, Kaiser had the ball poked away, stripped out of his hands, a foul called on Unity. Fouls on J.D. Ployme of Unity. That's his first. Two free throws coming up for Sean Kaiser. The minute 33 left to go in this first half. 44 to 37 in favor of Western. A lot of points up on the board. Kaiser's free throw is up and good. He's got nine. 45-37 in favor of Western. Brennan Granstra and Michael Veningen both back into the Western lineup. Another free throw for Kaiser. On the way, no good off the back of the iron. Hoekstra clears the rebound for Unity. Full court press put on by Western. Unity in the backcourt. Hoekstra with it, picks up the dribble. Gives it off to Poim and Western. Unity will take a timeout. Coach Ross Bauma up off the bench before Unity gets called for a 10 second count. 45-37 Western back in 30 seconds. You're listening to High School Basketball on KIHK. Okay. We are here ready to meet your real estate auctioneers. Check the frequently updated website at www.buyeronline.com. That's B-E-Y-E-R online.com. 122 left to go until halftime. Western Christian 45, Unity Christian 37. Unity breaks the press. Into the front court comes Hoekstra. Outlet pass for Coyne, poked away by Western. Herberg coming up the floor to the hole for the layup. Jack Herberg with the steal and the bucket on the other end. And now a whistle. 47-37, Western by 10. A foul called on a Western. That'll be charged to Brennan Granstra. That's his first personal. And to the free throw line, James Roundhorse for Unity. 47-37 Western by 10. 105 left to Roundhorse free throw up and good. 11 for Roundhorse. 47-38 now the starting lineup back in there for Western. Second free throw for James Roundhorse. That's on the way and good. 
47-39, a minute three left to go until halftime. Waltersdorf into the front court for Western, gives it off to Kaiser. Left side to Fatma. Fatma over to Kaiser. Kaiser bobbles it and gets it back. Kaiser on the dribble is cut off. Left side to Fatma. Looking underneath, out to Kaiser. Long three is no good. Long rebound picked up by Rowanhorse. Tips it off the hand of Fatma. And out of bounds, it'll be Unity's basketball. Fatma is slow to get up, but he'll be okay for Western. So Unity with the basketball back. 43.5 seconds left to go until halftime. Rowanhorse into the front court. Western in a 2-3 zone. Ploim, top of the key to Rowanhorse. Bounces it over to the right wing to Visser. In the corner it comes Hoekstra. Out of Rowanhorse. Rowanhorse cut off. Deploim on the left wing. Into Hoekstra. Hoekstra will give it back to Ploim. Ploim through the lane. Outlet pass goes by Rowanhorse. And into the backcourt. Unity with the turnover. Over and back violation. And Western will have the ball back. 17.6 seconds left to go in the half. 47-39 in favor of Western. Tonight's game brought to you in part by Hope Haven, Center Stone Jewelers, Iowa State Bank, and Vunk and Siouxland Insurance in the Professional Insurance Consultant Plaza in Rock Valley. Waltersdorf into the front court. Right side to Kaiser. Back for Waltersdorf on the wing. Top of the key to Fatma. Eight seconds left. Fatma to Waltersdorf. Into the corner. Gets his man up. Now a shot partially blocked. Waltersdorf gets it back. Goes up no good. Whistle and a foul underneath called on Ryan Hoekstra of Unity. That'll put Trevor Waltersdorf to the line with nine-tenths of a second left to go in the half. And Western leading 47-39. Trevor's Waltersdorf to the free throw line. 4-2 free throws. Two free throws coming up for Waltersdorf. He has 16 points in this first half. Free throw up and good. 48-39. Second free throw is no good. Rebound cleared by Rowanhorse. He'll chuck it down the floor. No good at the buzzer. And that's the end of the first half with our score Western Christian 48 Unity Christian 39 back with a rating points in the first half for Trevor Waltersdorf Jeremy Zutenhorst also in double figures with for Western with 10 James Rowanhorst led in the Unity in the first half with uh, 12 points Western's ball as we start the second half Starting five on the floor for both teams as we start the second half. Waltersdorf into front court for the Wolfpack. Right side it comes to Kaiser. Kaiser off the dribble. Into the right corner it goes. Three-pointer for Fatma, no good. Rebound poked out of bounds off of Unity. It'll be Western's basketball underneath. Couple of Unity players going after it. Gasing checks into the Western lineup now, replacing Fatma. Fatma may have gotten dinged up there. Kaiser with the inbounds pass out front to Gasing. Gasing top of the key, right wing to Kaiser. Kaiser back out high to Gasing. Over to Kaiser. He's open for a three. Long three-pointer. Good for Sean Kaiser. Kaiser with 12. 51-39 in favor of Western. Unity coming back the other end. They throw it away. Western will have the ball back. Gasink will bring it up for the Wolfpack. Joel Gasink into the front court, picked up by Kachi. Gasink at the top of the key, right wing it comes to Kaiser, down low. Zutenhorst muscles it up and in. Jeremy Zutenhorst with 12. 53 39, Western has opened up a 14 point lead and now a foul on Zutenhorst. Unity passing out to the left side to Hoekstra. Zutenhorst going after the steal and committed the foul. So Jeremy Zutenhorst picks up his third. Taylor Dreis will check out into the Unity lineup here. Is uh, Austin Kachi. And here's a jumper in the lane for uh, Rowanhorst. That's good for two. 14 for James Rowanhorst. 53-41. 
Back comes Western. Kaiser feeds it in the lane to Ben Grau at the right hand. The little jump hook is good. 55-41. Unity back the other way. Top of the circle. Kachi for three. Got it. Three-pointer out high for Austin Kachi. And it's 55-44. Western coach Jim Ekoff up off the bench. He wants a timeout. 6.40 left to go in the third and 11-point Western lead. Back after this 30-second break, you're listening to High School Basketball on KIHK. Back to action here in Hall. Western leading Unity 55-44. Western with the basketball. Waltersdorf out to Kaiser. Kaiser coming through the lane. Offensive foul on Sean Kaiser as he runs into James Rowanhorse. Kaiser picks up his second personal. And Unity will have the ball back. Rowanhorse will bring it up guarded by Waltersdorf. For Roundhorse across the timeline for Unity. Bounce pass right side, Kachi. Dustin Kachi on the dribble. Out to Hoekstra. Three-point try is no good. Foul called on the rebound. I believe it's going to be on Joel Gaysink of Western. It'll be Unity's basketball. So Unity will have it. Inbounds pass to Roundhorse. Roundhorse, left side pass to Kachi. Kachi has it poked away from behind by Gasink. Out of bounds off of Western. Still Unity's basketball. Kevin Fatma back into the Western lineup. He's got his right wrist taped up. He'll come in for Van Grau. Tonight's game on KIHK brought to you in part by Highway Chevrolet Buick, Ben Monins, The Station, and Miss C's Bar and Grill in Rock Valley. Lob pass on the inbound pass to Kachi. He lays it in, and the foul call on Western. Justin Kachi on the lob tips it in to make it 55-46. Foul was on Kevin Fatma, his third. Kachi to the free throw line to try to complete the three-point play for Unity. And his free throw is up and no good. Zootenhorst clears for Western. Whistle and a Western timeout. So timeout on the floor taken by Western. 55-46 Western by 9. Back in 30 seconds, you're listening to High School Basketball on KIHK. The best way to buy your insurance is from an independent agent like me, Jeff Coldmore, a C-9 insurance and a professional insurance consultant private. I get you covered in your home, auto, or house. You hunt through lots of different companies to get you the best possible coverage at the best rate. That's Sula Insurance, located in the new professional insurance consultant plaza at the corner of Main Street and Highway 18 in Rock Valley. I'm Jeff Coldenhoven, Let me save you money on your insurance coverage. 5.59 left to go in the third quarter. Western by nine, 55-46. Western with the basketball. Kaiser into Zutenhorst. Right corner, Waltersdorf. Back to Kaiser. Pull up jumper in the lane. No good. Roundhorse with the rebound for Unity. He'll push it up the floor. Left side, Kurt Slavin. He took an extra step, traveling the call. And Western will have the basketball back. So the Wolfpack bring it back the other way. Gaysink into the front court. He double dribbled the basketball. And a turnover. Western commits just their fifth turnover of the game. Unity will have the ball back. Malinorce will bring it into the front court for the Knights. Roundhorse, high post to Kurtzleben. Right side, Kachi. Kachi bounces it off his foot, but a reach-in foul. Called on. Kevin Fatma of Western, that is his fourth. Fatma picks up personal foul number four. Unity will have it out of bounds. That's the fifth team foul on Western here in the second half. And Kachi triggers it inbounds. 
Top of the circle with it for Unity is Austin Kachi. Not a round horse, round horse. Right side it goes to Hoekstra, to Kachi. Free throw line jumper, good for two. Dustin Kachi with the field goal. 55-48. Western by seven. Kaiser, left corner, Walterstorff for three. It rims out, no good. Offensive rebound to Fatma. He's fouled on his way back up, and he'll head to the free throw line for Western. Kevin Fatma to the free throw line to shoot two for Western. 58% at the line a year ago is Kevin Fatma. Foul was on Dustin Kachi of Unity. That is his third. First free throw for Fatma is up and good. 56-48. In favor of Western. One more free throw coming up for Kevin Fatma. Fatma tonight with four points, puts the free throw up and in. Five for Fatma. So it's 57-48, back to a nine-point lead for Western. Unity will have the ball. Travis Deckers is checked in for the Knights. Roundhorse into the front court. Roundhorse bounces the ball, left side. Hoekstra going to the baseline, is cut off. Turn around, jumper off the glass and good for Ryan Hoekstra. He's got six. 57 to 50. Western with the ball, and the ball tipped. Roundhorse trying to keep it alive. They kept alive, though, by Kaiser, now stolen away by Unity. Up the floor, Roundhorse pulls up. Jumper is short. Zutenhorse grabs the rebound for Western. Back come the Wolfpack. Walterstorff at the top of the key. Right side it comes to Gaysink in the corner. Zutenhorst back out to Gaysink. Gaysink over to Zutenhorst to Walterstorff. His jumper in the lane is good for two. Trevor Walterstorff has 20. 59-50, Western with the advantage. Unity with the basketball. Rowanhorst, left side it goes. Out on the wing, Kachi, and now into Dreis. His jumper from 10 feet out is good. Taylor Dreis with the field goal. 59-52, Western the lead, 3.56 left to go in the third, and a whistle, a foul called on Unity. Western's kamikaze crew, so-called kamikaze crew, set to come into the lineup. Dustin Kachi will check back into the Unity lineup, replacing Austin Kachi. That foul was on Austin Kachi, that's his third. Team foul number two on Unity. Western with the basketball, inbounds pass to Van Ingen on the right wing. Van Ingen to Waltersdorf, turnaround jumper in the lane, no good. Roundhorse with the rebound. Back in the Knights, Roundhorse gives it ahead to Hoekstra. Hoekstra, left wing, skips it across to Kachi. Top of the key, Roundhorse squares for three, no good. Off the front of the iron, offensive rebound to Dreis. Back up, no good. Decker's with it in the lane, he can't convert, and Van Ingen comes away with it for Unity. Van Ingen comes away with it for Western. Western back the other way. Top of the key, Waltersdorf. Right side it goes. Granstra to the hole. Off the glass it in. Brennan Granstra off the drive. 61-52. Nine-point lead again for Western. Deckers uh, coming up the sideline is fouled. Michael Van Ingen with the reach for Western. Van Ingen picks up his second personal foul. Unity will have it out of bounds. That's 16 fouls on Western. And uh, Unity will have the ball. Full court press put on by Western. Rowanhorse, right side it goes to Hoekstra. Hoekstra on the dribble, back to Rowanhorse. Rowanhorse, left side to Kachi. Kachi, outlet pass, tipped and stolen away by Western. Coming up the floor is the Wolfpack. Pass across the lane, tipped and stolen back by Unity. Kachi coming up the floor. Top of the key. Hoekstra looking underneath for Dreis. Goes off his fingertips and out of bounds. Unity throws it away. Western will get it back. High school basketball on KIHK. Brought to you in park by Verhoof Automotive. Buyer auction in Realty to Young Hardware in the American State Bank. Into the front court is Waltersdorf. Right side, Grandstra. Back out to Waltersdorf. Long three-pointer no good. Dreis clears the rebound for Unity. 
Drinks gives the ball up to Hoekstra. Hoekstra into the front court. Picks it up across the timeline. Right wing to Kachi. Kachi puts it on the floor. Now out front to Roundhorse. Coming through the lane. Roundhorse to the hole. Leaves it up and no good. Rebound to Waltersdorf for Western. Waltersdorf going all the way. Trying to dunk it. Missed. Whistle and a foul called on Taylor Dreis of Unity. I think it's going to be on Dreis. Nope, fouls on Dustin Kachi. That's his fourth. So Kachi picks up his fourth foul with 2.06 left to go in the third. You're listening to high school basketball action tonight on the Hot Country 107, KIHK, Rock Valley Sioux Center. Trevor Walterstorff at the line. It's his first free throw. It's a 10 point lead for Western, 62 to 52. Another free throw coming up for Trevor Walterstorff. He's got 21 points tonight. His second free throw also good. 63-52, Western by 11. Round horse into the front court. Western starting lineup back in there now. They're in a 2-3 zone defense. Uh, starters in there minus Fatma in place. Uh, Gaysink in there in place of Fatma. Here's Hoekstra coming through the lane. His pull-up jumper for Unity is good. Ryan Hoekstra with eight. 63-54, back on the other end. Gaysink, 12-footer, just inside the free throw line, no good. Rebound to Hoekstra. Back comes Unity. A three-point, uh, Kachi fakes a three, swings it out to uh, Roundhorse. Now to Hoekstra, back to Roundhorse. Roundhorse, pull-up jumper in the lane, off the front of the iron, no good. Rebound to Zutnahorse. Western trying to run. Here's Waltersdorf, he'll skip it across. Kaiser with the jumper, off the glass and in. 14 for Sean Kaiser, 65-54 in favor of Western. 109 left to go in the third quarter. Roundhorse, left side to Kachi. In the corner to Deckers, out to Roundhorse. Free throw line jumper, good for James Roundhorse. 65-56, back comes Western. Gasek out to Kaiser for three. No good, offensive rebound to Van Grau. Back up and in and a foul underneath on Unity. Then Grau converts on the putback, and he got fouled. Underneath is Taylor Dreis with the personal. Dreis arguing his case that he didn't commit a foul. He's not going to win that argument. Lucas Kurtzleben back in for Unity, replacing Travis Deckers. Three new Western players coming in. Jack Verberg, Michael Veningen, and Brennan Grandstra. At the line for Western is Curtis Van Grau. Also waiting to check in for Western is Jordan Vogel. Van Grau's free throw is good. He completes the three-point play. 68-56 in favor of Western. Unity into the front court. Dreis across the lane. Tipped out of bounds by Veningen of Western. Still Unity's ball. 42.7 seconds left to go here in the third quarter. Dustin Austin Kachi will trigger it in from the baseline to Dreis in the right corner. Dreis to Kachi out to Roundhorse. Roundhorse looking underneath for Kurtzleben. Ball tipped loose. Picked up by Grandstra. Ahead it comes to Verberg. Off the glass. No good on the rebound. A foul. They're going to call Goaltending on Unity, apparently. They're going to credit the bucket to Jack Verberg. 70 to 56 in favor of Western. J.D. Ployne into the Unity lineup with 30.1 seconds left to go in the quarter. Unity gets the ball inbounds. Here's Kurtzleben. Ahead it goes. Across the timeline is Visser. And now top of the key to Ployne. Ployme to the left wing, picks up the dribble in the corner, Kurtzleben to Dreis, down the lane, he gets fouled, and Taylor Dreis will go to the free throw line for Unity. Fouls on Michael Vening, and that's his third personal, Taylor Dreis to the line, he'll be shooting two free throws, 15.4 seconds left to go in the third quarter. And the free throw is good for Dreis. He's got nine points tonight. 70 to 57 our score. That ends 
An 11-4 run for Western. Second free throw for Dreis is also good. He's into double figures with 10 points. 70 to 58, full court press by Unity. Western gets it inbounds to Kaiser and a foul on Ryan Visser of Unity. Visser picks up his first, it'll be Western's ball out of bounds. High school basketball action tonight on Hot Country 107, brought to you in part by Floral Expressions. Jerry's Car Quest, Windmill Park Jewelry and Missouri River Energy Services. Walter Storff into the front court, down the right side of the lane, spins to his left, jumper no good, fight for the rebound, grabbed by Kurt Slaben for Unity. Unity coming up the floor, ahead it comes at the buzzer, Kachi from the free throw line, no good. That's the end of the third quarter, Western Christian 70, Unity Christian 58. Back to start the fourth quarter in a minute, you're listening to High School Basketball on KIHK. Who's that? Oh, well, is that Bayer? Circle and unlimited mobile to mobile minutes. Stop by the Monin's Radio Shack in Rock Valley, Sheldon, and Orange City for details on the My Circle Family <laughs> Choice Plan. The Monin's Radio Shack is an all tell I've heard she's station. taking a lot of heat for that, too. Eight minutes up on the board. We start the fourth quarter. 12-point lead for Western over Unity. 70-58. to 58. Unity with the ball. As we start the fourth quarter, Ryan Visser, left side pass, poked away, out of bounds off of Kevin Fatma of Western. Unity's ball again, inbounds pass, comes out high to Roundhorse, right wing Kachi, long three, no good, long rebound to the, uh, Ryan Visser of Unity. Roundhorse down the right side of the lane, banks it in for two, 18 for James Roundhorse. 70 to 60, Western by 10, Walter Stork. Right side pass, comes over to Fatma, out high to Van Grau. Van Grau back to Fatma on the right wing. Fatma trying to bounce it underneath for Zutenhorst, stolen away by Hoekstra. Unity coming up the floor. Hoekstra, right wing to Rowanhorst. He'll slow things up for the Knights. Top of the key, Visser. Visser, left side, Kachi. Bounce pass over to Rowanhorst. Rowanhorst to the top of the key. Unity will reset. Right side, Visser, now to Rowanhorst, inside to Dreis, back out to Hoekstra, now to Kachi, top of the key, Rowanhorst, three ball on the way, rims out, no good, offensive rebound to Kachi, no good, Kachi again, up and in, and a foul. Austin Kachi will go to the free throw line to try to complete a three-point play for Unity. Western's lead is eight, 70 to 62. That foul was on Jeremy Zutenhorst, his fourth. Kachi's free throw is up and good. 70 to 63. Western has had an answer each time uh, Unity has narrowed that lead down to six or seven points. Walter Storff on the right wing uh, for Western. Walter Storff to the free throw line in traffic, gets the shot off, no good. Rebound wrapped up by Austin Conchi for Unity. Back in the night, out on the right wing, Hoekstra has the ball poked away. Walter Storff on the breakaway for the dunk. Walter Storff with the steal and the breakaway jam. 72-63 in favor of Western. Unity with the ball, Kachi, top of the key, Rowanhorst, left side, Visser along three, no good, offensive rebound, Kachi back up, no good, and the rebound comes off to Zutenhorst for Western. Wolfpack back the other way, Kaiser along the baseline goes up in a crowd, and a foul underneath called on Unity, Sean Kaiser will go to the free throw line for Western. Fouls on Taylor Dreis, that's his third personal. Kaiser 
at the line, puts the free throw up and good. 15 tonight for Sean Kaiser, 73-63, back to a 10-point Western lead with six minutes left to go in this one. Second free throw for Kaiser, up and good. He gets them both. 74-63, in favor of Western. Roundhorse into the front court. Western in a 2-3 zone. Roundhorse top of the circle. Visser out to Roundhorse. Right wing, Kachi. Back to Roundhorse, brings it in a step. Left side, Hoekstra. Hoekstra trying to go baseline. It forces up, no good. Rebound poked out and tracked down by Visser for Unity. Unity will reload. Here's Austin Kachi inside to Hoekstra. Back to Kachi on the right wing. Kachi cut off to Hoekstra. Top of the key to Roundhorse. Through traffic ahead for Dreis. Off his hands. Picked up by Zutenhorse. And now Western coming up the floor. Western throws it away. And Unity will have the ball back. Unity will get it back. Dustin Kachi checks back into the Unity lineup. Top of the key, Roundhorse. Kachi, right wing for three. No good. Rebound cleared by Zutenhorse for Western. Back on the Wolfpack, but a steal by Austin Ka Dustin Kachi, and he lays it in. Dustin Kachi with the 11. 74-65. Western with the basketball. Waltersdorf, right wing, and goes to Kaiser. Kaiser through the lane. Slips, tips the ball out to Zutenhorse. Free throw line jumper, no good. Dustin Kachi with the rebound for Unity. Roundhorse to Kachi. Kachi traveled with the basketball. Western will have it back. Tonight's game on KIHK brought to you in part by Ski Mount Window and Door, DeYoung Hardware, Hague Memorial Hospital and Health Center, and People's Bank. Western with the ball into the front court, Joel Gasing, right wing Fatma, out to Gasing. Gasing hands it off to Waltersdorf down the right side. Waltersdorf ducks in. He's free. Ten-foot jumper. No good. Dustin Kachi with the rebound for Unity. Outlet to Roundhorse. Down the floor. Austin Kachi. Back to Roundhorse. Left side. Dustin Kachi. Down low to Dreis. Out to Roundhorse. Top of the key. Three ball. In and out. No good. Dustin Kachi with the rebound and the tip in. 13 for Kachi. Makes it 74-67 in favor of Western. Western with the basketball. Kaiser down the left side of the lane gets fouled. Sean Kaiser will go to the free throw line. And that may be on Dustin Kachi. If so, that's his fifth. It is, and it is. So Kachi fouls out with 4.03 left to go in the basketball game. Western on top, 74-67. J.D. Ploym will come into the Unity lineup for Dustin Kachi. At the free throw line, Sean Kaiser for Unity. Or rather for Western. Sean Kaiser, 16 points tonight, puts the first free throw up and in. 75-67. Back to an eight-point advantage for Western. And we have a timeout. An official blew his whistle. No timeout. Kaiser with another free throw on the way and good. Now Kaiser will check out. And Jordan Vogel back in the Western lineup. Nine-point advantage for Western. 76-67. Ploim takes the inbounds pass, gets rid of it to Austin Kachi down the floor trying to find Hoekstra, poked away by Granstra and out of bounds off of Western. Sean Kaiser right back in to the Western lineup, replacing Jordan Vogel. Unity with the basketball. Hoekstra with the inbounds pass to Dreis. Dreis in the lane, puts it up, no good. It rolls off the rim. Kaiser grabs the rebound for Western. He'll come back the other way. Kaiser out to Waltersdorf for three. Wave it off. Traveling call on Western. He missed the three-point try anyway. Unity will have the ball back with 3.46 to play. Western will press. Austin Kachi will trigger the inbounds pass for Unity on the near sideline. Down the floor to Dreis. Dreis passes out to Ploim, top of the key to Roundhorse. Roundhorse back to Ploim, 
Now Floyd, top of the key to Kachi. Kachi lobbing, trying to get it in to Dreis, taken away by Kaiser. Ahead it goes to Jack Verberg. He gets fouled going into the basket. Thought for a moment maybe they were going to call an intentional foul. J.D. Ploim with the personal. Verberg will go to the free throw line for Western Christian. And the free throw is up and good. Five points for Jack Verberg, 77-67. Ten-point lead for Western. Second free throw for Verberg, up and no good. Rebound tipped. And did he drop it out of bounds? Austin Kachi had the rebound, but apparently maybe he traveled with the basketball. Western has it, inbounds pass. Out high it comes to Verberg, now to Waltersdorf, right wing, Kaiser tries the three, no good, crashing the boards, Jack Verberg gets the rebound, he's fouled underneath. Western will have it, or they call a jump ball. They have called a jump ball that time, alternate possession, it'll still stay with Western. Here's the inbounds pass to Waltersdorf, now to Grandstrup. Grandstra at the top of the circle, dishes off, left side to Ningen, back out high to Grandstra. Now around the right side it comes to Kaiser, to Veningen, left side in the corner of Verberg. Verberg kicks it out to Veningen, back to Grandstra. Three minutes left to go. Here's Grandstra again, Western playing a little four corners here, trying to work the clock, Veningen on the left wing. Gives it to Waltersdorf, back to Vinningen, in to Kaiser. Kaiser to the baseline, throws it away. Stolen by Dreis for Unity. Now Ploim will push it up the floor for Unity. Ploim to Dreis. Dreis in the right corner for Kachi. The pass led him too far out of his reach. Unity throws it away. Western will have the ball back. Now Unity's going to put on uh, some full-court pressure as Kevin Fotman checks back into the Western lineup, replacing Michael Vinningen. Jeremy Zutenhorse also back in for Jack Verberg. Western's ball, full court press put on by Unity. Grandstra with the inbounds pass to Kaiser. Kaiser back to Grandstra, three on one for Western. Zutenhorse going in, puts it up too strong. Kachi with the rebound for Unity. Back come the Knights, Ploim gives it ahead to Hoekstra. He goes underneath and banks it in for two. Timeout Unity. 77-69 Western, 221 left to go. Back in a minute, you're listening to High School Basketball on KIHK. Hi, this is Paul, service manager at Verhoof Automotive. Before you and your vehicle enter the harsh month of winter. 30 or one minute, Doug? Minute. Okay. It was 30-11 in, uh, in the third quarter for points, and MOC got 30 points. What's that? 30 to 11 in points in the second in the third quarter. So what's the score? 55 to 43. Sioux Center's up 12? Yeah. No, MOC is. MOC's outscored Sioux Center 30 to 11? Yeah. MOC's up 12. They were on fire. Gee. Get. Western, I've only seen the Unity of Rock Valley Western, yeah. Just look for the checkered flag. That's pretty good. 221 left to go in the basketball game. Western 77, Unity 69. Kaiser into the front court. Right wing, Waltersdorf. Out front to Gasink. Gasink dribbles left side, pulls it back out. Top of the key, Fatma. Fatma guarded by Visser. Fatma puts it on the floor. Now out to Waltersdorf. Unity's got to think about fouling here pretty quick. Gaysink, Western playing keep away. Gaysink down the line, poked away by Kachi. And out of bounds, a reach-in foul is going to be called on Austin Kachi of uh, Unity. That's his fourth, and Joel Gaysink will go to the free throw line for Western Christian. Both of these teams coming into tonight's ball game 0-2 on the season. And uh, both of these teams, outstanding, outstanding teams. 
Western dropping their two games to Heelan in the Sioux City East as Gaysink hits the free throw. It's his first point of the game, 78-69 in favor of Western. Unity's two losses have come to ranked teams. Second free throw to Gaysink is good. 79-69 in favor of Western. Roundhorse takes the inbounds pass, stolen away by Western. Back out it comes, Kaiser to Waltersdorf. Back over to Kaiser on the left wing. Kaiser sends it out high to Berberg. Berberg gets tripped up. No, we've got a timeout taken by Western coach Jim Ekoff. He wants to run some subs in the lineup. What, no, he took the timeout. 1.43 to go, 79-69 in favor of Western. We'll take a 30-second break. You're listening to High School Basketball on KIHK. Announcing the return of Miss C's Full Service Kitchen in Rock Valley. Miss C's Kitchen is opening as of Tuesday, December the 4th. No, MOC. The is all new. And their menu is new. Now. Starting Tuesday yeah. the 4th, the noon lunch buffet returns every Tuesday through Friday. Miss C's will be back to their previous hours and back to their great dining yeah. specials too. Yeah. Don't forget their Saturday night prime rib returns on December the 8th. Remember, Miss C's is again serving their fabulous food starting Tuesday, December the 4th, so be sure to come in. Just a little bit. 143 left to go in the basketball game. Western on top of Unity by 10, 79 to 69. Western led 70 to 58 at the end of the third quarter, so Unity has been able to narrow the gap a little bit. Midwestern, each time Unity would climb within seven or eight points, Western has an answer and able to stretch it back out. Now the inbounds pass to Gasink. He's fouled immediately by James Roundhorse. Roundhorse with his second. That'll put Joel Gasink to the free throw line for Western. Now Western running some, both teams running some substitutes in here. Gasink at the free throw line. He averaged 8.4 points a game a year ago. Shot 75% at the line. Misses his first free throw here. That's just two points so far tonight. Both coming from the free throw line. Now Verberg and Granstra back in for Western. Second free throw coming for Gasink on the way and good. So Gasink hits one of two. Makes it 80 to 69 in favor of Western with a minute 41 to play. Western will put on 2-1-2 full court press. And J.D. Ployme into the front court to Dreis. Dreis on the right wing out to Ployme. Ployme back over it comes to Roundhorse. Roundhorse driving baseline, tries a reverse layup, has it blocked by Granstra, a foul called on Brennan Granstra of Western. That's his second personal. Rowanhorst to the free throw line. He'll shoot a pair of free throws for Unity. 80 to 69 Western with a minute 30 to play. Rowanhorst free throw up and good. 19 points for James Rowanhorst tonight. 80 to 70. The Western lead is 10. And another free throw coming up here for Rowanhorst. Both coaches right now substituting Offense for defense. Kurtzleben back into the Unity lineup along with Visser. Second free throw for Roundhorse is good. 80 to 71. Full court press put on by Unity. Western with the ball to get it inbounds. Now it's stolen by Hoekstrup. Unity with it back. Top of the key, Roundhorse. Left side, Hoekstrup. Hoekstra gives it back to Roundhorse. Right wing, Visser. Visser drives in. Lost the handle. The ball is loose. Rebound to Kurtzleben. Out to Hoekstra for three. Too strong off the back of the rim. Rebound cleared by Gasink for Western, and he is fouled. So Unity had an opportunity there to narrow the gap but couldn't convert. Western winds up at the rebound, and Joel Gasink will go to the free throw line. Foul charge to uh, Taylor Dreis. That's his fourth. And Gasink to the line to shoot two free throws for Western. Ten, uh, ten team fouls on Unity. Gasink's free throw off the back of the rim and no good. One more coming. Good crowd on hand for this one here tonight. It's been a pretty good game.
Second free throw for Joel Gasink up in the end. 81-71, 10 point lead again for Western. And again, Western coach Jim Ekoff running some defensive players in there. J.D. Ployum up the sideline for Unity. Did he step out or was he fouled? They're going to call a foul on Western and that'll put J.D. Ployum to the line for Unity. 106 left to go in the basketball game. So uh, with all the fouls here down the stretch, this game's starting to drag out a bit. That foul was charged to Brennan Granstra, his third. Ployum's free throw is up and good. Four points for J.D. Ployum. 80 to 81 to 72. Western's lead is nine. Another free throw coming up here for Ployum. That's on the way and good. Now Visser is back in. He'll replace Ployum in the Unity lineup. 80 to 81-73. Full court press put on by Unity. Unity commits a foul. Gasink will go back to the line for Western. So Unity is going to drag this one out as long as they can. And uh, with a minute four left, it's an eight-point game. That foul is on Lucas Kurtzleben, his second. And Joel Gasink back to the free throw line for Western. To shoot two, first one up and good. 82-73, nine-point lead again for the Wolfpack. After the game tonight, I'll be choosing the Pizza Ranch player of the game, brought to you on KSOU by the Pizza Ranch. Good things every day, actually. Since we're on KIHK, it'll be the center sports player of the game, brought to you by Center Sports, the sports lover's paradise. Second free throw for Gasink is good. Ten-point lead again for Western. Roundhorse into the front court. A minute left. Roundhorse down the right side. Bounces it out to Kachi. Kachi leans in. The shot rattles in. Timeout Unity. 83-75. 53.3 seconds left. Back in a minute, you're listening to High School Basketball on KIHK. Is buying or selling real estate in your future? About the sale or purchase of farmland? Thinking of upgrading or downsizing your home or acreage? I see land. This is Dale with Buyer Auction Realty. We invite you to stop in and visit with us at our new Sioux Center office just north of the First National Bank on Main Street. With our staff of professional sales associates located in several yeah. area towns, yeah. we are here and ready to meet your real estate yeah. and auction needs. Check our frequently updated website at www. I don't know about Emmitsburg. Are they any good this year? Are they? B-E-Y-R-Online.com. This is Marty from Young Hardware. General Electric yeah. has the perfect balance for your clothing care. Yeah. The Harmony Clothes Care System. It's the largest laundry pair with 4.0 king-size washer basket and a 7.3 yeah. yeah. two-foot dryer. Yeah. It's the fastest yep. premium dryer you can buy. Money. The washer even communicates huh? with Got the dryer. Got my meal money? All right. Where the washer talks and the dryer listens. For better clothes care, at Young Hardware Union Hall, your GE dealer, where we service what we sell. 51.3 seconds left. Western gets the ball inbounds. Unity immediately commits a foul. Sean Kaiser will go to the free throw line for Western to shoot two. That foul charged to Ryan Visser of Unity. That's his second personal. Sean Kaiser tonight, 18 points. Free throw up and good to give him 19. And it's 84-75. Western's lead is again nine points. One more free throw coming up here for Sean Kaiser. 51.3 seconds left, and the free throw is good. So 20 for Kaiser, 85-75. Unity with the basketball. Rowan Horse into the front court. Rowan Horse to the left side, kicks out to the wing. Ployme shoots for three, got it! Three-pointer for J.D. Ployme. He's got eight. 85-78, full court pressure by Unity. Gasink coming up the floor, is fouled, and Joel Gasink will go back to the free throw line. J.D. Ployne, uh, nope, James Roundhorse called for the foul, his third. And Joel Gasink will go back to the free throw line for uh, Western. Gasink now with six, all six points coming from the free throw line. First one is up and good. 
86-78 in favor of Western. 32.8 seconds left. Another free throw for Joel Gasink on the way and good. And it's 87-78. Tonight's game brought to you in part by Hope Haven, Center Stone Jewelers, Iowa State Bank, Vunk and Siouxland Insurance, and the Professional Insurance Consultant Plaza in Rock Valley. Here's Kachi firing a three. No good. Rebound tipped around. Ground by Ployme for Unity. Now inside, Kachi banks it in for two. Ployme with the offensive rebound. Austin Kachi in the lane for two. To make it 87-80. Western coming back the other way. Unity fouls. 14.4 seconds left to go. Taylor Dreiss picks up the personal. That's his fifth. Ryan Visser will check back into the Unity lineup. And Sean Kaiser back to the free throw line for Western. Kaiser with 20 points tonight. 11 of those here in the second half. And two free throws coming up as he tries to add to that total. First one up and no good off the back of the rim. One more coming. 14.4 seconds left. Second free throw is good for Kaiser. 88-80. Unity coming up the floor. Roundhorse, 12 seconds left. Roundhorse picks it up, dumps it off in the paint. Hooks for his shot is rejected. Grabbed by Roundhorse, left wing, lets it fly, too strong. Zutenhorse with the rebound, and that's the ball game. Final score, Western Christian 88, the Unity Christian 80. Back with a recap of tonight's game after this two-minute break. You're listening to High School.